So I'm about to do a seafood boil. This is my first time making it, so I got my um Okay, camera zoom. I mean camera focus. I got my still crab clusters right here. I got my shrimp. I got my potatoes. Potatoes at Kroger's they were horrible, so I was only be able to, I was only able to find two good potatoes, and I already had this one. Then I got my corn right here that I'm gonna cut up. I forgot to get my sausages. I got boiled. I got some eggs in there that I'm gonna uh, boil, and then I got my water right here, trying to warm up. So just stay tuned. So I have cut up my corn. I just did the two small potatoes that I had because it's just me and my son not going to eat this. So I just cut that up like that and then I washed off my crab legs real good. I oh, forgot a shrimp down there. I washed my shrimp off. So I got that. I'm not going to make that one because it's just me. So now I'm just waiting on the water to boil. I love when it came to a boil yet. So... These are the seasonings I'm gonna use. I'm gonna use this red lobster seafood seasoning. I'm gonna use some lemon pepper. Definitely gonna use some crushed red pepper because I like spicy. I'm gonna use some Cajun seasoning and a little seasoning salt, a little Tony's. Also, some of this Creole seasoning and pepper. Definitely some pepper. And I'm going to just use the rest of what I got. And then I'm going to put my corn in first. I'm going to put my corn in first. I'm going to cook that for about 10 minutes first. And then I'm going to put my snow crabs in and I'm gonna put the shrimp in last so I probably like the last five minutes I'm gonna throw my shrimp in and then a little bit after I put the crab legs in I'm gonna put my potatoes in so just stay tuned and see what I come up with so right now I'm about to throw my corn in I think that's too much water. Oh. So I'm about to let that boil for maybe about 10 minutes. Let that boil for about 10 minutes and then I'm going to throw the crab legs in. But now I think I'm going to take some of this water out. Because I think it's just too much water. No, not corn. So right now I'm just taking some of taking some of that water out. I don't measure, I just dump in some of this red lobster. Uh, the rest of these crushed red peppers. I can't remember if I said put Tony's in already, but put in a little mouth. Uh, some of this Cajun seasoning. I don't measure, I just dump. You can taste the broth as it go. Some lemon pepper. That's probably a little too much. And some more. Down here, quit yelling. That's my son yelling. I don't know why. I like spicy, and then 
I'm gonna let that boil and then I'll be back. I got some margarine that I put in there for my butter sauce. Now I'm about to add some garlic. Cover your mouth. I forgot to put some in here too. Cover your mouth. So I'm just about to let that melt. I got five more minutes and then I'm gonna dump the rest of everything. I'm gonna dump the rest of everything else in. I probably need to put my egg in. I just threw the same seasoning that I put into that water into here. Mom. What? Look, you're So now I'm about to throw my crab legs in and hopefully my pot is big enough because this is the biggest pot that I got. sit in there for 15 minutes let that cook for 15 minutes and then I'll say that's my timer I'm gonna say when it gets to like 10 minutes I'm gonna throw my potatoes in and then the last five I'm gonna throw my shrimp in so this is how it's looking right now it's already looking good And off camera, I did put some cayenne pepper in it, some rosemary, and some oregano, and my water in the um, my sauce over there. And that's looking good already. I got my potatoes left and my shrimp to throw in, and I'm gonna do one egg. Um, off camera, I just dumped in my potatoes, and I dumped in that one egg that I'm gonna try out, and then. Once you get the last five minutes, I'm gonna throw the shrimp in. So that's how it's looking so far right now. I just got it bit in a little bit. So now everything is done. So now I'm about to put everything into this bowl right here, peel my egg. I gotta warm my sauce up just a little bit. And I'll be back to show y'all what it looked like in a bowl. But it's done. It's about to be so good. So this is the finished look right here. All that seasoning. That's my sauce right there. It's looking good. Let me turn the flash so I can see. This is without the flash. The shrimp is hidden. I do got some shrimp over there, but they just, I should have got the um, the large, extra large, whatever. But they in there though. But thanks for watching. This is my first seafood boil that I have made, and I'm hoping it tastes good. It looks good, so hope it, hopefully since it looks good, it tastes good, but I'm gonna let y'all know at the end. Okay.